What's up, YouTube? It's Unk with no Neth coming back at you with another reaction video. Today's reaction video is going to be the luckiest people caught on camera. Man, if you guys are loving these reaction videos, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I would very much appreciate it. Just let me know. Let us know. We want to know. We want to know. You know what I'm saying? Like, just give us some input. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and jump into this. I, I came across this on the internet like um, earlier today, and I wanted I wanted to check it out. So while I'm checking it out, I'm figured, hey, why not do a reaction to it? So I'm trying something different. I'm trying to stay away from what everybody else is reacting to. I know that's probably the wrong thing to do because of you know growth, but I'm not. You know, that's really not my concern. Like I like I'm always on YouTube. I'm always using YouTube to learn something and stuff like that. So. It's like, you know what I mean? Like, I like this. So, it doesn't matter to me. You feel me? Um, but, <clears throat> as you can see, Neff is not here again. Like I said before in one of my previous videos, he has been really focused on sports now because he does a lot. And then he has school and everything and stuff like that. You know, And but we're going to be getting back together. We got some things coming for you guys. We are trying to plan our own live Randon Nautica experience. So we're gonna see how that goes and then um you know we got some other things coming too also we're gonna be trying to set up our giveaway soon too make sure you guys <clears throat> like us on social media it's unk and nef yt on all platforms instagram twitter and TikTok. okay it's not too much content posted up right now but just follow us we're gonna start the content real soon we're just trying to get everything moving get everything in sync and get on a schedule for trying to produce all this this type of content all right so without further ado let's go ahead and jump in to the video the ball just bounces your way an incredibly lucky moment to watch in an nba game was when russell westbrook missed an ambitious dunk but gets an extremely lucky bounce what gets the shooter's hole Sometimes we wish we could add special effects in our real life speeches. Somehow this groom managed to get an incredible effect when a lightning hit right after he said 2020 has not been the best year. 2020 has not been the best year. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it like some type of <clears throat> bad luck? Like superstition, like a bad luck superstition that if it if it's thundering or raining like or about to rain during your your wedding something it wasn't supposed something crazy i know it's something crazy i know it's something crazy when a redditor was making a slow motion footage of some bees he somehow managed to capture an amazing shot of a bee collision oh wow during Yo, a bee i never thought that would even be possible <clears throat> That's a first. In X race, after one of the riders made an incredible jump, which he didn't land, he lost the lead by quite a bit, but somehow managed to get himself up and actually passed the other riders and won the race. Wow. What? Wait, did y'all see that? That ride? Look, look, look at it. Oh, snap. We can often see whales leap out of the water with their jumps being about 50 feet high. An incredibly lucky moment for a tour boat was when the whale made a giant leap, but missed them by just a few inches. Wow. Oh! Oh! That would, not, oh! That would not have been nice. That would have not... Oh my god! Yo! That would not have been nice! Ah! Oh, what? <laughs> In a Matrix-like moment, when two guys were imitating Conor McGregor at night, somehow he was coincidentally driving by and stopped to say hi to them. And that probably made the guy's night. <laughs> a van driver got very lucky when his styrofoam box jumped back into his van while driving twice in a row. What? <laughs> Even though drone footage is usually pretty good to see at events, sometimes mistakes can happen with drones. A skier got pretty lucky when a drone malfunctioned and he missed it by just a few feet. Oh, Marcel. Oh, 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 oh,
C'est le drone Incroyable cette image Incroyable On allait perdre Marcel Hirscher hein. Ouais Oh Yo, that wouldn't have turned out good. That would not have turned out good at all. In what looked like a moment from the Spider-Man movie, a guy in motorcycle managed to avoid getting hurt at all when what? he jumped into the top of the car he hit. Oh, he's so lucky. At a car race, one of the drivers pushed another off the track, and in a one in a million save, it turns out that the push actually helped him get ahead. Started back here coming to the line, they got together and the car started wobbling and bobbling. At a motor racing event, one of the drivers got extremely lucky when he saved himself from what would have been a very bad fall and even finished the race on his knees. I tried to break something, so I just, I just wanted to, to save myself and, and, and the... When a man made a sort of DIY sled, he was sliding down a hill covered in snow, which led directly to a road in which two cars were passing by pretty fast, and the man got extremely lucky. Oh my god, he would have been dead. Yo, he would have been dead. What seemed to be an unlucky moment turned out to be a lucky one when Angelica Bingson's pole broke during the jump. But because of the pole break, she got another try, which turns out to be the national record. Wow. Like that. Better news is she's afforded another try as a result of that, so a, another third attempt to try to join him at the next height. Oh, snap. And putting the trust in her new pole, she gets over the bar. That's a new outdoor lifetime best. It's a known fact that skiing is not the safest sport. When one of the competitors attempted to do a trick while going down the hill, he got lucky and managed to stay upright and not fall. Oh. That continues on with that 180 at the back. Zeb graduated last year. What? A very scary and unexpected moment happened when a car was driving along a slippery and windy road. When all of a sudden, the trees on the side of the road started falling down. Luckily, no one was hurt. Oh, wow. At a baseball game, a foul ball got a little too close to a crowd member. Not very often we see a circus shot in the NBA. At a San Antonio versus Oklahoma City game, Russell Westbrook got very lucky with a shot that wasn't expected at all to land. Oh, wow. What? That thing took forever. When a wheel of a huge truck detached from the vehicle, the tires seemed to go straight for a man riding his bicycle nearby. Luckily, the wheel didn't actually touch him, and no one was hurt. A little known fact is that sharks aren't very aggressive and rarely attack humans, but that doesn't take away the fact that they're terrifying. A scary moment to watch was when a man made a jump to the water and had an encounter with a massive white shark. When a driver in a jeep was climbing a sort of hill, he didn't realize that at the top, there was another car parked with a person right next to it. So when he got to the top, the car's brake and the driver's reflexes were really put to the test. He'd have been dead. When a skateboarder was doing some tricks, a kid carrying his bicycle passed by and got extremely lucky. At a Boston versus Cleveland NBA game, when there was just a few seconds remaining, the team attempted a risky three-pointer, which didn't seem like it was going to go in, but ended up bouncing and tying the game with just one-tenth of a second remaining. I guess that Leprechaun does travel because the way this ball stayed up on the rim right here, look at the backspin that Bradley puts on that shot. Apparently standing up and grabbing something and putting it in its place can be a bit too much of an activity. These people got extremely lucky when the cup managed to go right in the cup holder by itself, thanks to the wind. <laughs> With F1 car going at speeds well over 200 miles per hour, it's almost impossible to stop or avoid hitting something if it randomly comes in front. An F1 driver got very lucky that a bird managed to save himself by like an inch of getting hit with the wheel. When some trees started randomly falling into the water, a couple that were cruising with their boat in the area just left the spot seconds earlier, wow. avoiding getting injured by the trees. When a plane was doing a takeoff in shallow water, 
The pilots got lucky to manage to take off completely, before getting into an unsuitable place to take off. A crazy moment to watch was at the Red Bulls Rubik's Cube World Cup, was when the competitors were actually twins, and the winner won by just 0 0.001 second difference. Oh, damn, both messed up so bad. Whoa! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Ball guys wait, is wait, wait, wait. Oh! one second the competitor. Both messed up so bad. I just 0 0.001 second difference. Both messed up so bad. 0.001 second difference. We're gonna slow that down. Hold on, I'm gonna show you guys because that was crazy. Uh, playback speed. Uh, is this slow or is this slow? Uh, I think this is slow. Let's go back to the beginning. I'm gonna show you guys. A crazy moment to watch was watch. at the Red Bulls watch. Rubik's Cube World Cup was when the competitors were actually twins, and the winner won by just 0.001 second difference. See? Did y'all see that? Look. Uh, I wish I can get the, the actual frame. Of that. But the, the, this guy over here wins, but he put his down first. That was bullshit. I call bullshit on that one. I, I call big time bullshit on that one. But let's go ahead and finish up the video. Oh! Bullshit. Bullshit. Oh! Fall Guys bullshit. has become a very popular game, in which you have to qualify by not being in the last ones to finish the challenge. And somehow this competitor got extremely lucky. There's a very well-known high-altitude theme park before. in Chongqing, which attracts see a lot of this on Instagram. thousands of tourists every year. And one of the attractions. Would you do that? Leave a comment in, in the um in, in the comments below. Would you do this? Because I definitely would. I would love to do this. This is a bridge that is 500 feet above land. An incredibly scary moment was reported when the safety cord released during one of the jumps, Ooh. and the tourist was very lucky nothing happened. What? Oh. Yeah, I just had second thoughts. I don't know. I don't. I, I don't. I, bro, like, no. I, no. What? Even though a staff member said it was just a publicity stunt after the incident, yeah, an right. investigation was made, and turns out it wasn't. At an NBA game, one of the players got very lucky with a two pointer when he didn't even try making the shot. Oh, shit. <laughs> An incredibly wholesome and lucky moment happened when a girl was on YouTube and found someone who looked exactly like her, so she decided to contact her. And turns out she was her twin sister, who were separated at birth, and they were even adopted the same day. Wow. I found out that I actually might have a twin sister. She found out that I exist through YouTube. Go YouTube! An Australian man, who miraculously woke up from a coma, bought a scratch card and won a car. So when the news reporter asked him to reenact the moment he bought the scratch card, he actually ended up winning $250,000 during the reenactment. When we asked Damn. Bill to reenact buying his scratchy ticket. I just won $250,000. <laughs> I'm not joking. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whew. Yeah, I like that one. All right, man. We're going to go ahead and wrap up this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to become part of the family. We welcome you. Arms wide open. All right? See you guys on the next video. Peace. I'm Ankh.